Hello everyone, hello, 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 welcome back to a Let's Play Blind XCOM 2, I'm the Black Shadow, I nearly forgot what the title of this series was, and last time, uh, well, what did we get to last time, uh, we are continuing, of course, our war with Advent, as you would expect, uh, I believe last time we were in the midst of, oh, goodness me, it was, um, like that defense mission, uh, we had that giant war in the streets, uh, but yeah, it was, it was bloody, it was very, very messy, um, and as such, our uh, our list of wounded is growing, unfortunately. Uh, Alan, Elwing, Brian, uh, Ashley, and Eduardo Perez, who um, was very, very well noted by a few folks, completely missed it, that um, Eduardo here, he's a reference. He's a reference to uh, El Macho out of um, Despicable Me 2, by the looks of it. Somehow, completely missed that this was a thing. I thought someone had just completely lost their mind. Maybe that's the same thing. Regardless, Eduardo did do a decent job for himself, although uh, it was uh, it was a messy, messy old fight, so that is unfortunate. We are, of course, busy um, constructing. Uh, we've got our scanning bonus to help with healing. We've also got, as well, uh, we're busy starting to construct our advanced warfare center in order to help with that as well. So uh, things are progressing reasonably well. All right, one more thing I forgot to mention. Uh, I've decided to roll in. I don't know if I said this before or afterwards, uh, but Loire, uh, Gallison's role. Uh, we've got a specialist in training anyway, so uh, I'm going to roll her in that. Which means that all of the previous participants for the series have all been rolled in. Uh, Eric covers everyone. So from now on, it will be flat random drawing of dice uh, as we would do normally, folks. So uh, again, as always, best of luck to you all. Right, there's a few other things that need to be touched upon over the last few days that have been mentioned about. First of all, uh, I want to have Pep into uh, research Work here. Is well underway, Commander. Um, so Tiger Busy is now uh, is busy doing the uh, research communications we need to do in order to actually, you know, continue with the game. I am very interested in getting hold of plated armor. Um, it is something that clearly we are struggling with at the moment. Is our soldiers do not have much health, and it's causing lots and lots and lots of problems. Uh, as much as I'd love to get the stun lance uh, thing as well, I think if we can try and beeline this, we might want to consider doing so. To do that, we need to get hold of alien alloys, and that means we need a... Was something of a God damn it. When it came to handling the interrogation and autopsy of alien subjects. Yes. From what I've heard, she was keen to get her hands dirty whenever possible. So to do that, we're going to need to get hold of some alien alloys. Um, now that means either clearing away one of like, these machinery areas or debris or something which might have some alloys for us. I believe that one does. I'd have to clear that away. Or we would need to um, get like a supply raid and uh, do something like that. Although, of course, that will be incredibly dangerous as we found in the previous run of this game. But we haven't seen one yet. Either way, that's probably something we should be looking to uh, go and die for. To, especially if we're at, like, if we get into May and we haven't got that, we're kind of in trouble, I would wager. New orders, Commander. We do also have a lot of supplies um, and the like as well, so we can look to construct some things. And after some uh, after some chatting here, I think we might look to actually look at getting the mimic beacon here. Um, it has been some praises of it have been sold to me uh, by folks watching the series. We need two faceless corpses, however, so I can't get it yet. But uh, that could well be a huge get out of jail card, perhaps if shit gets really nasty. So I might well delve into that. Uh, do I want another nanoscale vest? Nah, not really. I think we'll be okay. But I will look to get that at some point. Uh, Facility-wise, of course, we're busy building stuff as it is anyways. Uh, do I fancy, like, upgrading this? Oh, I don't have the power, of course. I can't do anything until I get that power coil done. Uh, so once that's done... Oh, that's what I've got the supplies for, to build that, right? That makes sense. Tygen seems to have a habit of scratching that scar on the back of his head. I wonder if anyone made sure his chip was actually removed. Really, Shen? I think you're just being, uh, what the hell? What, what the legitimate hell? <laughs> really? Ah, well, anyway, so, uh, one last thing as well before we delve into the bridge, folks. Um, I have been mentioned, and a few folks have talked to me about the fact that, um, these, uh, weapons, uh, that we've got hold of from the super stuff, like the, uh, the DLC, I should probably be looking to delve this out. Um, across my team, not to have it on one person, and yeah, I can't really argue with you. I can't really argue with you. So we'll be swinging those around our various characters as and when we get the chance. All right, all right, right. That is everything, folks. Uh, so let's head to the bridge. See what is going on. Commander, we've located the site where Big Sky took off from. 
No immediate signs of activity. Uh... Hold on. Might have something. It's a weak signal on an open channel. Access area. Region are of particular concern. Well. Haven't had any signs of her since we lost HQ. Commander, if there's any chance she or Big Sky are still alive, we have to get down there. So this clearly is the, uh, this is the second, uh, or this one, uh, whichever one it is, is the second, uh, DLC mission. We will not be touching this right now, because we will all die. But it's good to know that it's there. It's good to know that it's there. Right, what have we got? So two scanning sites. We're not going to touch us right now. We can't go to the black side yet, so we might as well just scan at home for now, which is increasing our healing speed, which is very, very dang useful. We have, of course, goods here. Mm, tempting to get a second scientist, but I need to keep the supplies for now. We need to keep those in the bag for building that power, I reckon. I say that. Extra research speed would be good. No. Commander, we have a priority message coming. Well, I didn't take long. Looks like an encoded signal from the resistance. Patching it through to your quarters now. Sure. Hello, Commander. Hello. Seen your recent activities have gotten Advent's attention. Our unwelcome guests are on the move. Advent has been diverting considerable resources and personnel to covert facilities across the globe. The exact details of these operations are highly classified. However, they do have one thing in common. A single word that appears in all their files. Avatar. I believe the black site we had previously uncovered to be but a part of this Avatar project. Based on what we have uncovered so far, its true scope is far greater. This project is being directed from the very top of Advent. From Actually. the source, I am still unable to determine. All attempts to uncover its identity have met with failure. It is time to take a more direct approach. <laughs> Though we may not know the exact nature of this Avatar project, we can still disrupt it. We must root out these hidden facilities with the help of local resistance cells, disrupt our enemy's operations, and in the process, uncover the truth. Locate the source of this Avatar project, and then destroy it. Were the enemy to succeed in their efforts, I am certain it would mean the end for us all. I am confident you will take whatever measures necessary to eliminate this threat, Commander. Now, I'm not We're one to uh progress on this Avatar project here. If they finish what they've started, it sounds like it'll be the end for all of us. Now, I'm not one here to uh, cast doubt on uh, the council spokesman, the board council spokesman. I wouldn't dare do such a thing. But surely if he doesn't know the details of this plan, how can he determine that its completion would mean the end for us all? It could just be like one big global lottery, right? Okay, maybe not. some people aren't buying it. Regardless, we will need to, uh, we'll need to do something about that. We'll need to do something about that, of course. Rapid response. Yeah, so uh, all Gorilla Ops will have some reinforcements. That's kind of a bit of a problem we have at the moment. It, it is definitely a thing. Right, let's keep healing then. Until something else decides to finish the fight. Like that! There we go. Our ongoing efforts, Commander. Thank you, Tygon. This, of course, is pretty crucial because it means we can now look to spread out our uh, our base. Uh, of our operations, I should say. We've got the resistance comms, uh, which we'll need to construct sooner rather than later. All right, and then resistance radio. So it's ground-based relays to further spread our reach. Um, it'd be easier for us to reach some of the outer outline regions far off HQ. We can delve into magnetic weaponry. Mm. 19 days is too long, though. 
Right, let's get this done because I will want to get hold of the blades. The Advent Stun Lancer was apparently outfitted with the intention of serving as a civilian peacekeeping unit within the city centers. Although they are equipped with weapons capable of administering non-lethal blows, recent reports indicate an increasingly aggressive stance taken by these units. Rudeness, right? Excessively rude. But yeah, more on that. That'll be fine. It gets the research done. It needs to be done anyways. Um, and then I reckon... I might do resistance radio after this. But yeah, I would like to get a plated armor. What I think probably once I get those alloys, I might just tank straight into it. It's going to take some time to research it. But I imagine it'll be worth it before all is said and done. That is my uh, that is my, my, my assessment of the situation. All right, okay, so now... We can spread out our communications, which we should Commander, probably do. We can now work to establish contact with local resistance groups operating out of regions around the globe. Once we've collected sufficient intel to make contact, we'll need to scan the target region for the operative signal. Right. I see no reason not to make contact here. After we pay the initial intel cost to make contact, we'll have to scan the region for a few days before the local resistance cell comes out of hiding. Once we find them, we'll be up and running in the new region. Right, let's make contact. Setting course for sector 10. Means no, uh, States. no, no home base uh, recovering, unfortunately. Commander, using intel collected so far, we've managed to locate a resistance cell operating out of this region. It'll take us some time to scan for their exact position, though. I'm sure. Attempting to establish local regional contact. Well, hey, good job, Laura. All right, then. Very, very good. Uh, so we might as well get another trooper sent. As I mentioned in previous uh, videos, we will be sending our random sort of troops here into whatever I think they're best assigned for. We might as well. Uh, so who did I have suggestions on what I wanted to do? Um, Leah and Conrad were down for sharpshooters, right? Especially Conrad, I think it was. Um, both our range... Well, our, one of our rangers is about to come out of injury, so that's good. So it'll only be that. Okay, then let's... Oh, yeah, it's quite a long time. All right, then. Conrad, you're going to come up next. You are going to uh, swing into uh, sharpshooter uh, training. If I could ever find the right thing. There we are. There we are. Conrad. Yes. Sharpshooter. I'll see you in a week. Okay. Back to scanning. Commander, we just got word that the resistance hit an advent supply line. Ah. We have an opportunity to salvage some high value materials, assuming we can clear out the alien forces guarding the site first. So, you guys remember what I was just saying about alien alloys? Give me two seconds. Radio then, folks. So, uh, this is going to be our squad for uh, for the dick. What the hell is that? I have no idea. So, unfortunately, a lot of our troops are still kind of uh, wounded, which is a bit of a problem. Uh, not much I can do about this, folks. It is just uh, it is just a fact. So, unfortunately, not the strongest team um, I would like to have brought along, but here we are nonetheless. Uh, regardless, everyone's got at least five health. I want to give uh, Mound here the armor vest to help with that. Uh, Loire has got the SMG with the med kit to give a bit of extra mobility, which is pretty nice. We are going to dish out a couple of extra weapons, which we ought to probably do. Uh, start off, Mr. Jack. Would you like a new handgun? I think you will. The way this one is sighted in, there's no excuse for missed shots. So as has been noted, uh, this will allow for wherever the hell it is. Uh, there we are. So the pistol is guaranteed to hit. If the target is killed, the shooter will gain concealment, which is very nice. Uh, bonuses to critical aim, critical chance, and aim. Lots and lots of cool things. Lots and lots of cool things there, folks. Uh, he's got battle scanner as well. Any other thing I want to dish out here? We can't use the axe. The frost one I don't want to use. Uh, the bolt caster. I'm really forced to keep a lot of range here. I think I'll leave the bolt caster for another fight. We'll leave that for another fight. I think, I think this will do. I'm pretty happy with this uh, set of as it is. Yeah, it'll do. Right, let's go get ourselves some uh, some goodies, everyone.
Hopefully this loading screen decides not to take fucking forever. Sometimes they do. I don't know why. It's this game. It doesn't matter. Oh, that's better. We're targeting an advent troop transport that resistance forces managed to disable in this region. The aliens aren't expecting to see us, so this is our chance to seize whatever technology they've got on board that thing. We're expecting heavy resistance at the site. Move in and neutralize all hostile contacts and secure the area. Now, do note that um, I don't have any grenades on me, folks. Uh, no frag grenades. I have no way of like shredding anything that might or might not be armored. So that's something that needs to be borne in mind. That could be a problem. That could be a problem. Right, here we go. The advent troop transport is nearby. Engage and eliminate all hostile forces. Probably down that sort of way. You know what? I'm not actually too sure. I assume it's that sort of direction. All right then. So, uh, well, we got some high ground. I would like to very much keep said high ground. That sounds like a wonderful idea. I love how Jack's got the most health here. Just kind of weird and kind of also makes no sense. But uh, well, I can get behind it. Right then, let's uh, move forces around here. I quite like this map actually. Moving to it's really good. I might, I might uh, buy the end of this thing. This. this was the worst map I've ever seen, but I have eyes on the enemy. Good spot. How the hell did you see that? Well, regardless, you did. All right then. Bear in mind, of course, we will start off as concealed, which is always nice. No need to ask twice. And we'll just on Overwatch. Too much here. I'm going to assume the transport is in that sort of general direction, although it's hard to know. Do I want to keep uh, Jack up here? This looks like a really good map for squad sighting. It looks like a delicious map for squad sight. All right, Lua, do you want to head up first? You've got the uh, move for the SMG. So it makes sense for you to do a bit of scouting. The introduction of human DNA. Hello. These creatures once operating under the guise of Fen Men now show their true form. A purely reptilian species. No reason for them to hide. The aliens don't need an infiltration unit anymore. Nope. Okay. Right. Moving on target location. I don't think Jack's moving from where he is. The question is, where do I put the rest of my forces? could go down here, actually. You know what? I like that idea. I like that idea very Stepping much. Off. We're going to move towards this corner, actually. I think this is going to be a better uh, better overall game plan for us. We are a little bit on the exposed side there. On my way. So this seems a bit more sensible. Until they walk over here, I'm like, oh, God. That's fine. We've got no time limit. We take as long as we need. Uh -oh. mm, this may not take long for this to uh, erupt into combat, though. What? Well, you need to not be there. Can you get over there and, like... Rolling. I don't know how comfortable I am with having you down there, actually. You know what? I'm not comfortable with this at all. No, you get the hell up. Heading out. Alright, Jack. That will be your spot. Moving to designated position. That will be your spot. Can you actually run across the Oh you can. Oh that's good to know. Alright then, that will be your spot. I think I'm gonna look to use height again. It's still early games. So I still think height advantage. I think means a lot. I value height advantage quite a lot here. Yeah, they're coming across. That's a problem. Stun lancers as well. We know how fucking dangerous they are. Okay, they're gonna they're gonna move over all of that way. I'm okay with this. All 
all about picking a spot here. Looks like quite a big map, actually. How do I intend to engage combat? What's the plan here, Shadow? Yeah, that negates the any weapon. Wow, you only got one percent range loss uh, in that. That's pretty awesome. Right, I think I'm just gonna wait here. I'm gonna let these guys walk away, and then I think we're gonna ambush these guys next turn. So, ah, uh... oh, there we go. Yeah. So Shadowfall means it's guaranteed to hit there. It's its own ability. Okay, that's that's neat. Let's just uh, just take it easy. If I actually take what? Oh, a little battle scanner down there. Just tell me. Uh... Just so I can sort of see what's going on. Or I could lob one in the base. Or attempt to lob one in the base. Just to get an idea of what's going on. I like that idea. Let's see what's going on in here. Yep, he is indeed scanned. Okay. It's so obviously their uh, transport thing there. Scanning. So we're just going to wait. And the next turn, surprise. probably, it's going to be a war. Is he now permanently on our radar? Oh, boy. Oh, man. I don't have any explosive. I could flashbang them. And just unleash hell. I don't think I can actually throw a flashbang. Well, nearly. I could flashbang and go to war here. In fact, I actually think this is what we're going to do. Confirmed. That's probably a large contingent of their forces. So it looks like we're about to embark on a war here. Good copy. Get Moving a on closer. Target. Most can't have any there. Let's get you up here. Understood. Moving out. Overwatch. Okay. Roger. Got my eyes on. This could get messy. Here Let we go. Your eyes. There we go. Disorientate the lot of them. Attack! They're like, that didn't affect me. What the hell it did? You're not dead. Well, you're dead. And you're dead as well. Very good. That was a bit... Whoa, sorry about that, folks. My bad. Something's fallen down there. I don't know if we're going to get hold of that. Star Lance is going to get some free movement, though. Although, do remember, they are disorientated, so they don't have anywhere near as much movement as they normally would do, I believe. So they may be forced just to shoot here, which is fine. That missed. I'm all right. But I think that was the right decision. Flashbang a lot of them. Yeah, see, they're not uh, they're not charging here. Because they know they can't reach. There's no slash ability for them, so they're just going to fire from full cover. Chance here for uh, you to do some flanking. That'd be pretty nice. Kathleen, you're going to have to draw some fire here. Well, I don't know where the fuck I'm going to put you. I guess you're going to have to just go there. Moving out. No, that didn't trigger the uh, didn't trigger the Overwatch. That's a bit unfortunate. That's a shot. That's a hell of a shot. It would make sense this channel fall here, actually, because it would be guaranteed to hit, right? In theory. That is an option. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, let's try this out then. That's pretty cool. So he now gains concealment again. Hey! Good job! You got promotion. Well done. There you go. So he's now reconcealed. That is actually quite nice. Not gonna lie, that's pretty cool. Right, we can get. No, I can't flank you, can I? No, of course not. 
Right, I think we're just going to stick up high here and just uh, take some, we'll take a shot here. And then the thing you can just like overwatch probably. Oh. Yeah, yeah, this is acceptable. Yeah, I missed. No everything's going to hit, I suppose this is understandable. Adjusting aim. And we'll just, uh, we'll just overwatch here. Yeah, disorientation is gone here, so I suspect he might go for a charge. But I'm ready for him. Oh, bollocks. Well, that's bad. That's really bad. Oh, there goes uh, concealment. Well, that's unfortunate. I think he slashed and missed. I don't know what quite what happened there. That was interesting. Lots of strange things just occurred. Shit. How the fuck am I going to get to you? I might be able to get a shot Moving off here, actually. Location. Very good, carefully. 29%. It's a bit awkward. <laughs> I think I just have to, uh... Well, you need to die. Don't you? You kind of... You just kind of just have to die. Free damage? Really? Wow, that's kind of, uh... That kind of sucks. The law, of course, has no actions here. You need... This just has to kill him. Oh, Kiro. You are good. You are good stuff. Right. Meanwhile, I think this is worth a go here. It's only bound, anyways. Worth a shot. Nah, missed. No other options really available to me. I'm glad I gave you that armor vest. Still bound, of course. There goes that. The law, of course, has the healing item as well, so that's unfortunate. We have to charge here. We have to charge. Understood. Moving out. Well, ninety-two percent, everyone. Still moving. Ninety-two percent. Ninety-two percent. Heading there now. That, ladies and gentlemen, sucks. Near getting angle. Somewhere where you're not going to just get murdered next turn, though. I wonder, actually. Okay. Oh, you have no longer have Shadowfall, do, don't you? Yeah. Have a go. So you only get that once, uh, uh, once the game you get to use that ability. Okay, then. Well, good news, folks, is she's alive. For now. Loire, you need to get the fuck out of there. Um, am I likely to kill you? Depends on this. I could overwatch. I don't see the point in overwatch though. You've got a flank shot on uh, Loire here. You might as well go for it. If it hits. Oh, it did hit. Oh, I think we get ourselves out of drop here. It only do dodged him. it though. It took minimal damage. I'm well, low on ammo. this just needs to kill it. Ooh, just. close that was close that could have been that could have been night night loire Moving to got away a bit position. all right let's uh resort ourselves out here folks we're all a bit of a mess very lucky easy now soldier right you heal yourself please jeez that was close moving to designated position reloaded that probably deserved to go even worse than it did, but hey. Oh. Stay clear of those turrets. We're still not entirely sure if they're fully automated or remotely triggered. Well, that's kind of a problem. It's got armor as well, so damaging this is going to be a bitch. Good shot. That armor's tough. It is indeed. 
Yeah, we're just gonna have to slowly, uh, we're gonna have to whittle away at this. Do I pull you back? I could hunk you down. Whoops, wrong button. That sounds like an idea, actually. We're just gonna hunk you down here. Holding. If we leave you in some sort of sight, gradually the idea I could employ here is that Kiro can, or Jack even, should be able to gradually, you know, kill it. There is some logic in this. I'm on the move. Right, you need to you need to reload anyways. We're green to go. And you might as well just move forward here. Position confirmed. Uh Yeah, pull over this way and we'll just okay. reload. We don't need to do anything too crazy here with this turret. Don't need to totally lose our minds. Tempting as it is to take some shots, though. It's very tempting to take some shots. There's no full cover here, is there? Oh, that's full cover! Closing on target position now. Yeah, sure. There you go, some damage dealt. Hard target, minimal damage. Yeah, well, that, that's fine. We'll work it out. Whee! Got it. Good job, guys. Target down. Well done. Promotion for caffeine as well. Very nice. If you survive, we'll have ourselves a new contender in the in the ranks. Very nice. You need to reload. Still enemies about though. We're not done yet. We're not done yet. So how do I want to uh, run things here? Rock and roll, Overwatch. This whole building here. Right, we just need to slowly make our way uh, closer towards this, I suppose. Get over there, Jack. I might have to throw a battle scanner, actually. See what the hell's going on. That's affirmative. Got it covered. Just take our time. No rush here. No rush. Position confirmed. Come get some. We do need to. Uh, yeah, there's there's still a target around. I'm convinced of this. Let's lob it down here. See what's going on. They're like the back end of the facility. Empty. Yeah, that sucks. Kind of hoping to spot whatever the hell it is we're still missing. But alas. Moving to position. But we're just gonna have to slowly start inspecting the uh on the move. Inspecting this place then. Until we find one looking for. Oh there they are. Hello. That must be the last of them. I think I'm probably pulling Ashley back here. Yeah, 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 yeah. I think I'm pulling Ashley back. Good copy. Moving on target. Did you get a shot, Lamar? Oh yeah, there is a trooper over there. This is true. Move into designated position. Caffeine across, get a better position. And by better, I mean actually worse. I'm on it. I think we just have to overwatch here a bit. Can move Loire across. Can you get up there? Not in one turn. Could be made to get up there and then help out next turn. You know what? I like this idea. You do that. I'm all over it. Good camera work, game. Good camera work. Here comes the sectoid. What kind of mind bullshit he's going to try? Reanimation! Well, I mean, it could be worse. Trooper's looking for some uh, better positions. I'm oh, not quite achieving it, though. Is that one is is Overwatch, though? I don't think he'll move. No, he's not going to move. There's no reason for him to move, so. It's going to be a little bit pitched, this, I reckon. Right, what do you got the wild angles? 69, 57. Yeah. 
Put you up there for a reason. Good shot. Need to work out what I'm going to do with um, this damn... This damn thing, though. Oh, shit. We don't really have an angle on the uh, on that, actually. That's kind of distressing. Right, pull it back, Jack. Pull it back. Yeah, we need to we need to deal with this this damn zombie. Makes good sound. Right, Kathleen. Yeah, pull it back. I'm happy, to, I'm happy to see a bit of uh, happy to see that flank. There we go. Deals with you. Target eliminated. That's for you, Ashley. Hmm. This is not a comfortable spot. Yeah, we should probably pull you back too, shouldn't we? I'm trying to find some full cover to throw you back to, though, which I guess that's about as good as we've got. Are you likely to be flanked by the trooper? The answer to that question is quite probably yes, which I do not want. I need to avoid that at all costs. You're in danger of getting flanked as it is. That seems like the best spot I can think for you, actually. I can just pull over this side. Yeah, let's pull it over this side. Then. A little bit he more heavily armored. Wow. I did not expect that to hit. That's a hell of a shot. Alright, let's see what the set toy to next move is. Move for you. You can't run. Yeah, no grenades or anything, so that's unfortunate. No. Kathleen! Yes. Oh, oh, fuck me. Well, we're charging, everyone. We are charging. Incoming fire. The set to it is going down. Big mistake, pal. I gathered. Right, you just need to fucking die. I'm on the move. There you go. See? Kill confirmed. Told you that was the wrong move. Right. Do I get shot on this actually? I would very much appreciate it. Yeah, have at him. Yeah, good stuff. I don't think I can realistically get a flank on him here. I might just overwatch here with uh, with Jack. This is acceptable. Heading to that location. Right now you've done, you know, had your little hissy fit here, uh, Kathleen. Goodbye. Wow, we landed a few Enemy like destroyed. not great percentage shots in this match, in this fight. Not gonna lie. Status confirmed. I went really All well. Are down and the area is Good job, everyone. Status confirmed. Mission accomplished. Good job. That was really, really good. Really solid. More of that, please. Yeah, look at that percentage of shots, shot percentage. We. We overperformed today. <laughs> we overperformed and uh, spoils all around for the team. That was a really solid mission. It's one of the better ones we've had so far this run. Very impressed. Uh, it's Ashley, unfortunately, is going to be. Um, or was it Ashley or was it Loire? I think it's Loire, actually, who's going to be uh, on the bench for a little bit, but it'll be worth it. All right then, time for some plunder. Excellent work, Commander. Your efforts in the field have certainly encouraged the crew. Yeah, it got a bit hairy with you with that fucking viper, didn't it? That was uncomfortable. 
But, uh, you know, it was all right. Everyone gets promotions. Good job. So who are you next now? Thought that was another new specialist. All right. Someone else to roll in next time. Very, very good. We'll roll the promotions now, sure. Uh, Loire, um... You know what? Roll combat protocol. A lot of folks will be running medical protocol. We'll run you into combat. We got our first sergeant, I believe, of the game. Uh, Mr. Jack Dawson. So I'll be able to give you full customization options in the next one. Well, guys, we got Deadeye. Um, take a uh, smart shot with a small aim penalty for a significant damage boost. Um, or lightning hands. Fire your pistol at a target. Does not cost an action. Mm, that's quite... That's potentially really nice. You know what? I think I'm happy to keep you on, like, the sniper one. We can send, like, uh, probably El Macho down this path here. Lightning hands, that looks fun. That looks fun. Good stuff. Also, having a sergeant means you have access to some facilities now to construct as well. And, Ashley, we'll send you down there. All right. Good job, everyone. Good job. Oh, yeah. Here's all the goodies. Mm-mm-mm. Mm-mm-mm. Of course, we got a Viper Autopsy, as well as the Turret Breakdown. We need more missions to go that well, everyone. We really, really do. Right. Okay. So. Oh, also more supplies. This is also good. I might get building something here. More buying something. I never got around to asking you, Doctor, but... Uh... What exactly did you do before the invasion? At one time, I was employed as a biochemist in the pharmaceutical industry, mainly researching vaccine production techniques. Because of my background, I was rounded up by Advent and put to work in one of the very first gene therapy clinics. I saw firsthand what their technology is capable of, for better or worse. I'd say we're lucky to have you with us. I appreciate the sentiment. Hello, Commander. <laughs> I'm sure you do. All right, I've got some decisions what I want to do with my supplies here. We have our alloy, which is very, very promising. Work is proceeding as expected, Commander. So once we're done with the stun lancer autopsy, I'm pretty, pretty damn sure. Is that so? We have access to take whatever we want now. Medical supplies, eh? Hmm. I am intrigued. Right then, we're going to let uh, the stun lancer research be done here. Um, after that, I think we're going to go down the Viper autopsy. That sounds very interesting. And then we will dive into plated armor. Now that we have our alloys, that is an option. I mean, it's going to be a long time to get re resistance radio, though. I think it's worth it, folks. I think it's probably worth it. We have psionics we can start researching as well. We've got a lot of things. That supply rate has opened a lot Dr. of um, a lot of paths for us. Vigil over my activities is starting to wear thin. I consider myself a patient man, but eventually she's going to have to trust me if we're going to achieve our goals. I'll have a chat with her, Tigan. I'll have a chat with her. Right, I'm going to leave that video here. So thank you much for watching, everyone. Yeah, next time. Uh, we, oh, we also need to finish making content in the eastern US so we can look towards heading towards the black site. Uh, and again, we now also have the sergeant as well. So we can look to actually, you know, uh, we can build the leader training station now that we have a sergeant. And we also can look to get hold of, what building was it? Maximum power consumption reached. Well, that we need. Uh, it was the warfare center, wasn't it? I think. Um, there's something we can get to, like, start expanding our squad out and stuff and those sort of abilities. That would also be really fucking useful we got a sergeant. So anyways, I'll thank you guys so much for watching. And yeah, I'll see you next time when I've decided more what the hell I actually want to do. I'll see you then.